Yo guys, welcome back to the channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you and telling you guys how you can actually complete all the Fort Bite challenges, the new challenges and how you can actually get the rewards for them and show you what the rewards are in today's video. But before we get into the video, if you guys do come over to the item shop and you do fancy getting the Enigma wrap, it's such a sick wrap, or the cryptic skin for free in Fortnite Battle Royale, the back bling is pretty sick, it's like a hologram of a spine, all this Enigma wrap which is animated is, is extremely cool, I really do like this wrap. But if you guys want this for free, all you need to do to like enter the giveaway way is like the video subscribe to the channel put those post notifications on drop your epic in the comment section below and stay active on the channel if you're not if you're not staying active on the channel you won't be able to pick any of these up but yeah let's get into the video So if you do have loaded up Fortnite and you are on here, if you go over to your challenge section, you'll see this new Fort Bite and it does have a timer. The reason we have a timer for these is every time that timer runs out, we get some new challenges. As you can see, we've got a lot here and I haven't completed many, but they are extremely easy to complete. As you can see right now, a number one awarded for gaining 175,000 XP. So it's not just in-game challenges, you have to get XP, you have to go to certain locations. For 13, find at location hidden within the loading screen, hashtag two. So we have to wait until week two challenges come out to actually get this challenge but i mean they're, they're gonna be pretty easy i don't know what it's just gonna disclose like a secret towards this season i don't know what it is gonna do but what we're gonna be doing in today's video is gonna be looking at the sentinel on a frozen items so you have to wear the sentinel skin in the battle pass if you guys don't have the battle pass i suggest you go look at my video yesterday because i just i just said i can all get it for free i personally think that these are challenges are super easy so just award by battle pass tier 40 you do need the battle pass to access these challenges as well so awarded battle pass tier 100 awarded by finishing top 10 in squads duos or solos 25 times that's not exactly hard but if you guys do need help with all these remember to smash a like on today's video drop your epic in the comment section below i'll be picking some of you guys up to get some of these challenges completed for you awarded by finishing top 10 in squads 75 times this day they just take time like you can't exactly rush any of these awarded for completing six challenges from week one. That's pretty easy. I'm gonna probably going to do that very, very soon. But in today's video, like I said, we're going to be going to this disclosed location on a frozen island. So yeah, let's just hop straight into a game. So once you are in the battle bus, you'll be disclosed at a certain occasion. But we do need to go head over to this island right here. These, these aren't exactly hard to complete. If you guys are struggling to actually find one, simply just YouTube it and there is, there's this person doing tutorials on every single one. He's doing really well for himself. I'm, I'm not going to lie, he's doing really well. But the, the fastest way to complete these is just focus on the challenge. Don't do anything else because if you need like if you need to get top 10, just sit in a bush or something. Sit in the middle of zone of every single circle and you should be good, pretty good. I suggest getting top 10 in solos because it's much more easier to do it in solos and squads. Personally, these challenges challenges are really easy and we don't know what we're going to get for the picture but I do know what we're going to get for the rewards I'll be covering them after I do this challenge this is where you need to go to the location to actually do your challenge yeah as you can see this guy is doing it as well give me the kill boy right so we got rid of that problem and now you are on this island and as you can see you can't really see it anywhere but if you guys do look to your left it's very faintly it's over here so if we hop down over here, it does appear accessible with Sentinel skin. There we go. You have to stand by it by a couple times. And there you should have the new, like, I don't know what you'd say, really, the Fort Bite. I mean, they're pretty cool. It's a pretty cool idea what Fortnite have done. But there, we're just going to quickly collect this. As you see, one out of Frozen Island. That is being completed. We're going to quickly jump off the map. And we're going to go look at the rewards and what we have got with completing this challenge. So once you're back into this lobby, it doesn't give you an extra stream. But if you go over to your challenges, as you can see, I've got 2%. There was 100 challenges and I've completed two. There we go. As you can see, we have got a new picture. But we don't know. It sort of looks like Bunker Jonesy, not going to lie. Or the Peely skin. Now, it looks like Bunker Josie's beard. I mean, it's this really big picture. I don't know what this is going to do. But that's literally all you do for completing the challenge. And the rewards you actually do get for this. So if you go over to your... Uh, where are they? They're in challenges, actually. Yeah, go over to your style and just look how many you have, man. They're insane. But collect Fort Bites. You can get this harmonic axes. These are so sick. Like... Not even gonna lie, these pickaxes are probably one of the favourite I've actually I've actually seen in Fortnite. I don't think there's any more. Oh yeah, let's collect Fort Bites here to get all the bottom bottom styles. I mean, I'm not a fan of the bottom styles. 
top style is probably the cooler ones. But then in the Sentinel, this is where stuff gets cool. We get the we get the hot wings. That they must have a selectable style because you wouldn't just get the silver ones. You'd obviously get the black ones for the dark version as well. But then collect 20 fort bites for this emote. Bro, it's such a sick emote. It's just insane. I'm not sure if you get. Um, oh no, that's just for completing weekly challenges. But I don't think there is any more except from Bunker Jonesy, of course. Collect four bites to get the banana, right rippers, and you get the banana cape, which is um, pretty disturbing. Poor Peely. And then in here, you just need these. You do get for four bites as well. And the, the challenges are really easy. These are obviously four bites. These are obviously four bites. They're not exactly hard to complete, I'm not going to lie. That is Fort Bite as well, I'm pretty sure, or that is. One of them are Fort Bites. They're not exactly hard challenges to complete. The fastest way, personally, I say, is look up a tutorial on, on uh, YouTube. Or if you think this really simple, like awarded for gaining 30,000 XP, it's just playing. So make sure you're hopping in a squad with people to get the most amount of XP as well. I'll be doing a video on that tomorrow about how to get maximum uh, skins as fast as possible. But yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy the video and it did help you out a little bit. If you if it did help you out, make sure you smash a like on today's video. Subscribe to the channel, put those post notifications on. Drop your epic in the comment section below to get some of the stuff in the item shop. The item shop is pretty sick today. We've got the Oblivion back. We've got the Cryptic and the Enigmas wrap, the Cryptic skin. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Peace.